Alrighty, folks, back with the second video of the day, man. We just got a lot of rage quits with the first one, man. See, I detailed it for you guys, man. Detailed it for you guys, man. And that's something you should definitely do when you're playing a stun deck or when you're trying to build a deck that's uh, control based. This hand is good. This hand is good. Sadly, we didn't really draw anything too spectacular. But I know what we can do. I know what we can do. We can definitely just start off with Bloom. Do I just start off with Bloom here? Because if I start off with Bloom, I can just get a full line straight to the fucking hand. Like straight to my motherfucking hand, bro. Oh, I, think, I think Mizuki is actually just better. No, 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 no. We're going to go with Bloom. Bloom is just absolutely too good. Too good not to be used in first turn. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get that for free and like I said, we have a twin twister and we also have a, a drag down And we also have battle protection. So worst case scenario He's not gonna be able to attack over anything that we control But yeah, if you're playing a control deck and stun deck always try to be a step ahead of your opponent But don't do it in real life Like don't say shit in real life Like if you say something in real life, you will your opponent will realize what you're saying and then think around it Just don't say anything try to keep a straight face, but um, yeah, man, I, I, I done lost like four five times to that like literally Saying something at the wrong time and then my opponent just fucking pretty much being able to figure out what to do and then come back from there um, so you just keep your mouth shut in real life, but Commentating you guys for I mean comment. Why would you do that? That was kind of stupid um, But hey man to each its own everybody's going to play the game. They want to play but uh, yeah, man, so I, I feel like starting off with the bloom kind of sets the tempo for my opponent Scares them into not uh, I guess attacking or something unless they have something to negate my forlorn Because forlorn doesn't play when she hits the field. She's just an amazing play And like I said, this is a starter, but man, this is so unusual man. because I'm usually opening up with a sucker to a, a Sorceress and, to, and we're just getting random stuff and we're just going off from there so easily during the end phase we're going to do this and then we're just going to probably set the tempo for the rest of the game here um, and then so we don't draw into a zombie world we're just going to activate this one um, we're just going to activate we're just going to activate this just to not draw into a zombie world and there is not the zombie world but that's this hand is just bonkersly good now then the, now this has become just really out of hand for this man and like, like i said we don't care we don't care about the ash we don't care about the ash now the ash does not matter and I have to believe he's waiting for uh he's waiting for the bloom which he should do but I think this game is over oh no he does not wait for the bloom we're gonna special summon this immediately and then what we're gonna do here is activate this and then this is gonna special summon my three star sadly sunset has to choose a Shiri Nui to bring out sadly but um yeah man uh, we have to choose a sure new to get out with sunset effects is this not two zombies which would have been perfect for those two but um yeah we're gonna do this and then what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go straight into a sun saga because sun saga is um, how, how much was uh, 815 but everybody gains a hot 300 so that's the extra 900 there's the ghost ogre which kind of would have hurt but we have the uh, we have the young we have the young what's the name so we're good we're gonna banish spiritualist and then spiritualist is gonna gain and we're gonna pop this for free and then we're gonna activate spiritualist's effect and I believe that's game is it not game I don't think it's game oh he surrendered that was no it's 4400 44 plus 31 that was 7500 it wasn't game but we were definitely getting some places there folks Ooh, that's the first one. Let's see if he wants a rematch. He does not want a rematch. All right, we'll go to the next duel. All right, here we go against Monty Pyro. We're going second this time. We're going second. We've opened up Twin Twister, Froiloin, Banshee. What a swallow slash. This is great. This is great. Um, this is great Yu-Gi-Oh. But if we... Oh, okay, never mind. No, this, is, this is great Yu-Gi-Oh. This is just great Yu-Gi-Oh, folks. Um, yeah, man. But yeah, you always want to think a turn ahead of your opponent. There's a soul charge. I didn't like that. I didn't like the soul charge. Um, we're going to just normal summon Banshee here and just go and go straight to the attack. Um, no reason to use any effects. No reason to do anything. We're going to take it a turn by turn. Um, let's see what our opponent's even playing. All right. He's not playing anything. Um, main phase two. We're going to sweat the ah, set the swallow slash over there. Um, hopefully he doesn't have a twin twister of his own. It probably is going to be a scapegoat of some sort. I would say. 
Oh, it's not nothing. All right. So now this game is just, it's, it's going to get a little out of hand here, folks. And I'm, I don't know what else Shirinui we should play. Um, that's absolutely fine. Thousand Hour Restrict would be a very bad play because this is a quick, oh, well, okay. Um, maybe not. Maybe not to you guys. Maybe not. So we're just going to go ahead and activate this. Go ahead and get rid of these two cards. Um, trap Tricks. Son of a bitch. Um, what are you playing? The reason why you're... Oh, Evenly Match. Oh, Jesus. You're playing Trap Tricks for Evenly Match. That's cool. We'll activate Spiritualist. Spiritualist activates. We'll draw a card. Oh, and discard the Bloom. Oh, look at God. Look at that. That is crazy good. That is just crazy fucking good. And wow, why did I do that? Um, you know what? I'm not going to special some of the monster. <laughs> because if I do, he's going to go into battle phase and evenly match me. So no, we're not going to special some of the monster. All right. I'm glad I caught myself. I'm glad I caught myself. We're going to activate the Zyber World, though. We're definitely going to activate this. So we're going to probably deter anything he else he has in store for us. Oh, we almost, we almost got caught in that. But definitely during the standby phase, he's going to get hit with this Twin Twister. And um, uh, should he get hit with this Twin Twister? Oh, he's definitely getting hit with Twin Twister now. Now he's definitely getting hit with Twin Twister. 100% he's getting hit with the Twin Twister. Um, and then standby, we'll go ahead and bring this young lady back. I mean, young young, young monster back. That's what he is. He's a young monster. Shout outs to, uh, shout outs to the MK scene. I don't know if you guys watch MK, but uh, yeah, that's that's them all right so then here we can literally just send another bloom but he does play what's name so why did i not do that did i not use juicelle's effect fuck it um that was an accident that was not supposed to happen but we're gonna use this effect um i probably should have used uh what's the name's effect to uh, honest uh yeah we're gonna special on that monster instead he has a thousand eyes restrict, but if we special summon it, <laughs> he's going to be able to, uh, uh, we can't even go to the sorcerers. I think I have to go sucker and just try to just draw a card because then he's going to, he's going to be able to kill me. He's probably going to have another evenly match in his hand. I already know how it's going to work. So, you know what? That's what exactly what we're going to do. We're just going to go sucker with these two. Fuck it, you know what? Let's just go for it. Fuck it, let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. He has, oh wait, could we have killed him? All right, I think we could have killed him. No, that was only 300 more attack. Uh, let's see. Oh, he doesn't have it. All right, so that's fine. What we'll do here is go straight into a sucker. Then we'll use sucker's effect to get the thousand eyes out. We'll draw a free card because of sucker. Ooh, there's a banshee. Uh, and then yeah, we'll just end our turn there because like I said, we get another free draw Doom King activates Special summon that activates and then we can just activate this And we could banish the thousand eye restrict we just gave to him and draw another card. All right, so we're, we're, we're in good hands uh, Baron it evenly match that if he does evenly match me zombie world is going and so are these two cards over there Oh, you're playing magic bullets Oh, I don't think he understands Drusel can negate. Why didn't you just wait? Um, this draws two, right? Yeah, I don't care about that. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're playing the the link. Wow, why why would I? I would never expect fucking magic bullets. You're gonna kill it, but oh, you are you playing CCG? Um, yeah, let's just stop all that. Let's stop all that attacking, bro. Let's stop all that attacking. Let's stop all of that attacking. Go ahead. Come on. Re Redeclare your attack. I'm paying 3,000, bro. Paying 3,000, bro. Exactly. See, that's our no. That's our dogwood right here. We got our own personal dogwood. He's already used the what's the name, so it doesn't matter now. Now you're done for. Max is negated. He definitely could have won. I don't know what he was thinking. He definitely could have won. 100% could have won. 1,000% folks could have definitely won this game. Not one, but wait, what is the one? You can add spells and traps up to the number. Yeah, he definitely could have came back. 
Yeah, he, he, he definitely messed up. But we're going to get another one. Oh, he wants a rematch. We're going to give him a rematch, folks. We're going to give him a rematch. He wants one. Never mind. He doesn't want one. He said the zombies are too good. All right. So hopefully we can play against uh, a deck that can put up some sort of fight because now we're just rolling through people. Um, okay. This is... Uh, oh, we have Soul Charge. All right. This hand is bonkers. This hand is really good. So what we can do here is go first this. Want to definitely bait out the ashes that he does not have in his hand, which is fine with us. So then we can do this, discard that, and then we can soul charge for two. Bam, bam. Yes, why? Who wouldn't be? Why would I not be playing Zombie World, sir? Like, come on, my guy. Um, we're gonna use this. I think here we'll throw. Actually, I think we can throw Spiritualist. I think that might be the better play. Yeah, we're gonna throw Spiritualist here, folks. Why is because we're gonna go vampire cycle with these two. With um, wait, no, no, no. I need to use uh. Let's keep, let's keep Gozuki. No, we have to get rid of Gozuki. I don't know what I was thinking. Um, yeah. So we're gonna use Gozuki's effect. We're gonna banish this. We get the sunset over there. That's gonna trigger. We're gonna draw a card. Ooh, I think. Fuck. I don't want to get rid of Ash. I don't want to get rid of Ash, but I don't want to get rid of Swallow Slash. I think Ash is better, but Swallow Slash is just too good. We'll just get rid of Ash right now. We'll just do it. We'll do it, man. We'll do it for the we'll do it for the peoples back at the back, back at the hotels. Um, so then we'll be able to draw a card. Oh, there's a rivalry. All right. So then, then that that turned out to be correct. So then, actually, oh God, that was an accident. We can target this to get out. Uh, Hmm. Oh wait, we actually can't. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Did I just do a messed up play? So I can target this, and then with these two, I could bring out. I can bring out Banshee. I think that's where this is going. And then I can bring out Banshee. Yeah, let's. We got to bring out Banshees, and then we got to use these two. I think we can go Phoenix here. Actually, I think we just go Skull Deep and draw four. See that we probably should have went. Uh, yeah, actually, we should have did that because then we could have got. Um, we could have. We already used Unizombie though. Yeah, actually, we could have actually did a lot better play. But you know what? You know I don't like better plays. I could risk it for the biscuit and go Skull Deep. Do I want to do that? Yeah, we could have made a lot. We could have made a definitely a better play. Matter of fact. Hmm. Do I care about him knowing what my card is? Fuck. You know what? I'm going to go Skull Deep for the fuck of it. Fuck it. We're going to go Skull Deep, folks, because I easily could have made a better play. But, you know, we, we're, like I said, I, I like making terrible plays. I like making bad plays. What I definitely should have did was got Goblins on because that would have guaranteed whatever, basically whatever type of card I wanted. Oh, there's the Burial. All right. That works out pretty good. But then there's also Drew Shell. There's also Drew Shell. I think I'm gonna keep Drushel. So we gotta put back Designator, Twin Twister. I think Swallow Slash, man. Yeah, we gotta just put these three back. So then we use this special summon uh Drushel. And then Do I just keep all that banisher right now? I think so. I think we just do that. We'll just keep that for next turn. I think we'll just keep that for next turn. Barn a twin twister, we just lose here. <laughs> I said, barring the twins, so we just lose here. We definitely could have made a, a 20 million times better play. That was definitely not thinking ahead. Yeah, we definitely could have made a entirely better play. But, folks, it's okay. We're going to be able to... What the fuck is going on? Oh, yeah, he, this game is over. This game is like 100%... Wait. Um, if you control fire more, five heart, like, yeah... Like I'm not, I'm probably not even going to use Doom King's effect here. I should, huh? I should. Actually, we're gonna let him summon to trigger the effect of this. Hopefully, hopefully he triggers the effect of this guy. And if he triggers the effect, oh, he doesn't. Okay. So, all right, he's going to use this, and then we're going to chain... All right, there we go. We're going to chain this, 
then we're gonna chain rivalry and then the game is over um banish we're gonna banish the 1900 so what's the name doesn't die um yeah and then now he's just done he's done right he can't do anything yeah there we go quick surrender let's see if he wants a rematch does he want to re no he doesn't re nobody wants rematches nowadays okay all right, folks, so yeah, oh wait, we didn't even have Gomb Zombies, so that whole play I was just thinking about was just literally null and void. That was uh, pretty stupid of me, but we got to where we needed to get to, uh, even though that was a pretty bad play on my part. Um, I could have just used Sunset to get uh, Spiritualist and Mizuki back out, and then we could have just went from there. Um, I don't really know what else we could have did, because there was no tuner that was banished, so. But, um... I don't know. We could have did something probably different. I don't know. That was pretty cool, though. What well, We keep getting rage quits. Nobody wants to rematch. But I guess, man, like I said, you guys leave your comments down below of uh, what you want to add to this deck or how I should change the deck and build this deck or let you know your personal deck. Now, what I do kind of want to add, and I know this is going to go away from the zombie part, but, folks, it's, it's just too good. What we can add is the Phantom Knight engine, and what we can do is just add the link and possibly two three stars maybe two three stars maybe just one um the the one that searches the trap and then two fog blades and then the other counter and probably cut out um one swallow slash probably one of these because technically you only really need one to resolve so i can cut one one out i can put in two fog blades uh two what's the names we can probably i don't know what else we can cut though i don't know what else we can cut um yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what else we can cut. Probably cut Unizombie down to one. Um, but then that'll bump us up to if we take two out for two fall blades, that's even. If we take a uni out, put for another trap. Uh we'll probably be at 44 or 45. Not, but yeah, probably like 44 cards. But then we also can add in a guaranteed two effect negations and probably Drusel. So I mean I think then we'll be good. But I don't know. You guys let me know. I'll probably throw that in, probably switch it up with, you know, I don't know about the dangers, but we'll throw some other stuff in here. We'll try some stuff out. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, tomorrow should be, I guess, D Heroes. Do I want to play that deck? I do. I'm going to play D Heroes tomorrow. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I'll see you guys back tomorrow for sure. And also, if you guys can, click that to help support the channel. Appreciate any support you guys do. And yeah. Thank you very much.